everybody and welcome back to another video on Dino Squad. Today we're gonna jump right into the battle and let's just get right into it. If you saw my last video you would have um, seen how tanky the mantis has become. So I think if you level the mantis enough it does become more of a tank than a, like a brawler or a sniper or something. It used to not be able to withstand that much damage, but I was in my Monarch and it I was shooting at a Mantis, several Mantises, and they withstood a lot of damage. I'll put that up in the upper right corner for you guys if you want to watch that, but it was a pretty interesting video. So it looks like we're going to run into mid and try to cap that real quick before anybody tries to compete for it. Unfortunately I only have a sniper with me which is not the best for mid capping but looks like this player was able to do it. So that's good. Let's try to possibly get rid of him before he can get rid of me. I'll try to help out my team a little bit just from standing in the bushes and not taking unnecessary amount of damage. I killed him with the bite ability and it gave me a good amount of health back so that should be able to... Yeah, he used his bite ability on me which does critical damage. So let's see, let's jump in with the Primark at mid and try to brawl out a couple of these players here and get rid of them. I did my tail sweep just before him by a few seconds almost, so I think he took more damage than I actually did, so that's good. Let's just tail sweep him. The <laughs> same thing happened again. We both did it at the same time, so now just because I have a little bit more to help than him, I was able to kill him. Now let's see, I thought something went behind us, but I don't know. I'm going to slow him down just so that he doesn't kill too many of our players. And I think, yeah, okay, so they neutralized the beacon, but that's good for us since we were right here. So it just gave us more points after we capped it right back. I'm not going to use my tail sweep ability on him just because he's just a sniper and uh, I was getting sniped by another sniper. I'm going to jump into my own sniper just so that I can get rid of some of the other snipers. They're causing a lot of trouble here. Okay, I was just watching the guy in the back to see if he was going to cause me any trouble. Okay, I hammered in a really good on that guy's side, but a mantis has already been spawned in. I don't know how on earth. I don't understand how these people get their mantises so quickly. But he didn't stick around to cap the beacon, so I was able to cap it back and just gain more points easily. Let's do some damage to this mantis over here. See, he's taking like zero damage right now. Even though I was in my sniper mode. Now I'm gonna need some help with this reaver because I'm a sniper and I can't really hit them too good. Okay, they did take care of it, which is good. I'm gonna try and snipe his head a little bit. Headshots do critical damage. Uh, but there's too many people right in front of me, and I cannot see through them. Okay. I'm wary about my left side. It looks like the Primarch's the only thing holding off the people over there. So, I think I'm going to let this Reaver, if he wants to kill me, kill me, because I don't want to stay in the Sniper when there's so many Rexes and stuff around. It would be better to be in a Primark or something of that sort. 
So I think he should be taken care of, and that Primark is dead, so... Let's see... Oh, okay, a Scorcher? Let's snipe him a little bit. Get him right in that... Okay. I'm gonna back up a little bit because he's getting really close, and that's bad if he hits me with his scorchers or just step on me altogether. I'm doing massive damage to this guy, which is good, but it looks like they've just spawned in another one. I'm gonna try to take this beacon from afar, but it's not easy with the sniper's weapons to take a beacon. This Primark is trying to get rid of me because he saw what I was doing. I'm running back into the cover of my team. This is my team, I think. No. That's just a giant scorcher battle over there. Hopefully, that's the flames of a team member. But I'm not sure. I'm trying to snipe this guy before he can do... He ran past me and now I can't find him. Okay. I think our scorcher will be able to do something about him. Oh, I think he's sniping me. No. I I got the kill for that somehow. Oh, this beacon is a one shot. Yeah, okay. So, they cap this beacon. I'm going to go behind and try to cap that one after I cap this one back. And let's run back. This is just more points for us. They're just making the beacon white and leaving it just so that our team can cap it back and give us more points for capping. So thank you red team for being so kind and gracious. <laughs> Looks like we got mid back too which is great. We had lost it for a little bit there. My sniper's at really low health so I'm just going to sacrifice it a little bit by putting it out here in the open. Okay. I'm going to go in sniper mode as soon as I can. Okay, I'm sniping him really well from here. Got him. I got rid of that sniper as soon as he spawned. And we got D, which is really good. So they're not that much of a threat anymore. I got the assist for that. And now we're just going to be spawn raiding them, I guess. Which is also fine. I'm not getting hit indicators on this sniper over here. Huh, I'm not getting any hit indicators. I don't know why. I'm, yeah, I wasn't even hitting him anyway. He's still at full health. Well, now he's not, but he was at full health. Yes, I got the last shot on that weaver. I was able to snag it. There is nobody behind us, I'm pretty sure. Oh, I didn't even get a chance to get in my monitor. That's okay. We were able to quickly cap the beacons, and since I didn't get... I was mostly in the sniper, I did place fourth. Because snipers, they just kind of lay back, don't do that much. But let's jump right ne into the next battle, and hopefully this time, we'll be able to jump into the monarch. Actually, in the... In my other video, uh, I got, I was using my Monarch and I got monster times 12 with it. So the Monarch is a really, really good beast. And it's one of, part of the um, extra large dino, T-Rex um, category. So it's in the category of the Dominus and the Curie type, not the Mantis, Scorcher, and Nobel. So it is the cheapest of all three of them. But I would say it's pretty much equivalent to them. Because Dominus is their brawlers. Um, Curies, their snipers. And the Monarch is just kind of mid range. So that's why I decided I'd get a Monarch instead of a Dominus or Curie. Because I don't really like sniping, but I am pretty good at it, actually. Oh, I want to stop them from getting this. Beacon. Oh, they did get it, unfortunately. I bit him. 
gonna take down this beacon as much as I can. I took it down about halfway here, so. I'm on my own again. And they bit me. I was outnumbered wait, by too many weavers there. Let me try to get in the Primark and push back. I don't know, should I go for D or C? Uh, C is pretty low right now, so I'm gonna try to get that. Oh no, somebody's sniping me. No. Sniping is such critical damage, I can't take that damage right now. Okay, sniping, our sniper is standing on it, which should be good. I got some points for that because I was standing on it. And it looks like we have actually a Scarab on our team, which is great for defending beacons and taking out beacons. Okay, this might be my end because he does have the double weapons, the double medium machine guns. So that's good. That's bad, I mean, that's bad. Let's see if we can, uh, I don't wanna take a risk with the sniper when he's in his sniper mode, just because they're really deadly. They already have a Scorcher yet again, so I'm gonna try to take up this Locust if I can. But I did get taken out by another player. I was at low health anyway. And I'm going to go in my sniper with on B and try to snipe out some of the Rexes and other snipers. I do like to target the Locusts because they're just so dangerous. So, yeah. Okay. Even though he's dead, those smoke clouds can still do damage to you, so stay away from them if you can. Oh. This is an enemy just standing right here in front of me. I didn't even notice. That's also an enemy standing right there. Okay, now it's time to run for me. Um, if I run down this hill quick enough... Yeah, he's following me. So I probably won't be able to. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure Old Pappy is a YouTuber as well, right? How did they get our ba our home beacon as well? Ay ay ay. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure Old Pappy is a YouTuber, or that player over there is just a fan of Old Pappy and used his name. But I think he is. I'm not entirely sure if that's actually him or not. Okay, so let's take out this wasp, actually, I think it is, as quick as we can. Capture B back, and there's Locust going for mid. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to take my Monarch in, just so that they don't get this beacon. And, ooh. I'm going to roar on him, actually, because they do so much damage and they tank through damage I did kill him but I'm in a really bad position I'm gonna try to get back out of danger hopefully in time we did kill him oh no there's a lot of players coming up this beacon right now I'm trying to kill this mantis right here, who's just ignoring me completely. I got assist, but we were able to count the beacon back, which gave us enough points to kind of even out the match. And now I'm taking damage from behind. I couldn't kill this guy because he stepped on me, but I think he's going to be taken care of anyway. So I think I'm going to jump into the... Reaver and try to cap beacons. So when B is ready, actually let's go to C. I hope, yep, I was just gonna say I hope it's not a T-Rex, but a matter of fact it was. I bit him, 
he ran with his ability instead of biting me, which was good. And somehow, somebody still saw me through the bushes. Okay. Let's go in with the Primark then. Yeah, let's just do the Primark and try and do something about the amount of players that are coming at our base. If this Locust is coming right here, I might be able to intercept him with a Tail Sweep ability. Maybe. Uh, actually, there's no point. There's either a Dominus. Yeah, okay, so it's a Dominus. I'm just gonna stick by his side. I think that Scorcher should be able to take care of him. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. They have a Dominus as well, which isn't great. And a Dominus one-shotted me. I was at super low health anyway, but even if I wasn't at low health, I would still be have been one-shotted. So, there was really no point. I'm gonna actually get in my sniper and try to snipe some of these people down. Cause sniping is actually pretty effective, so. Yes. Okay. Sniper. Hit him right in the head. He's doing critical damage to me, actually. Oh, uh, it was a sniper. Ugh. I'm going to go in with a hmm, Reaver, actually. I'm, I think I'm going to try and get some beacons when everybody's in their T-Rexes. And hopefully don't pay attention to me. Excuse that again. Okay. Let's see if I can stand over here and get it. Oh, I'm getting sniped by old Pappy again, I think. But I did, um admit defeat to that there was they all had um dominuses which are really powerful dinos yeah so there w we didn't really stand that much of a chance and yeah old peppy i think he actually might be a youtuber because he did place first so yeah anyways guys if you enjoyed today's video make sure to leave a like subscribe and comment down below if you know if that was actually old peppy or not the youtuber and yeah, I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.